here we are on the scene. A great abundance of chemtrail snot is all over my yard and we're going to prove beyond a doubt that this nefarious substance that our friend down by Malak is actually as terrible as it is. So let's replicate part of his ex quote unquote experiment. Oh, look at that, it's disappearing. It must be burning. Oh wait, I saw a drip. Surely it's burning. Okay, let's stop that. Let's stop that. Let's, let's do this because we don't want any of these dangerous chemtrail chemicals getting into the house and poisoning our minds and bodies. We're gonna put it in a sealed container. Because that's what a scientist would do. Let's go shut this torch off. Because that's what a scientist would do too. So here we go. Sealed up for safety and science. bring this in here and we're going to bring it over to our scientific scale to do more science. Now let's weigh it. 8.8. .8. All right. I'm sorry. 8.8 .8 ounces or for our friends in Canada, 250 grams. Now let's let this sit and we'll come back later and see if this is evaporated or sat here because I am not burning it. So how else could it possibly disappear? We'll see. So now, our evil, nefarious substance has completely melted. And we see that it weighs the same as it did before. But surely, this dangerous substance must be flammable. Because the quote-unquote snow, the alleged snow, was burning in your video. Well, let's try that. Now, surely, if this is flammable and everything melted, the most flammable part would be gases trapped inside. 
Look at those evil, deadly, flammable gases. Oh no. So we gotta be, for the sake of safety, we have to keep this sealed. And then we'll try to open this up and we'll try to ignite whatever gases await us inside. What's wrong? It's the liquid, the evil chemtrail liquid. That's what's flammable. Let's try to set that on fire. But see, I don't want to put it in the plastic because my wife would kill me if I burnt her plastic. So we're going to put it safely in some aluminum foil. And we'll try this again. Does it burn? Come on, burn. Burn just like you did when you were allegedly snow. No? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It put out my lighter. You put out my lighter, it doesn't, it doesn't burn. Oh no, it put out my lighter, how could that be? Let's analyze this from a scientific standpoint. It didn't burn. Because it's water. Because it's fucking snow, you fucking moron. But, lucky for you, we can still put this aluminum good use. Because, after we're done proving that you're a moron, made you a little hat you can wear. A little tinfoil hat of your own. 